Hi, it's Gary. Welcome to today's video. Inkvent calendar, day 18. Where are you? Here we go. Found it quick. Day number 18. This month has half been moving along. Can you think 18 days? Well, it's about a week now till Christmas. And we've got here Blizzard. Beautiful, like bright blue there on the label. I know we can't go by the label colours, but I like to like try and guess what the ink colour will be from it. So Blizzard, there we go. 12 milliliter bottle. Looking on the side, it's a shimmering. I think this is either three or four days in a row when we've had shimmer. Loads of shimmerings, isn't there, in this ink vent calendar? And this looks like is that a silvery type shimmer? I could see that, silver for snowflakes maybe, with a blue background. I could just see that, you know, where you get blue, which is frozen water has that blue color. Let's get this all shaken up. We'll fetch in a swatch card, a coloring card. Always sounds like I'm saying the word coloring. It's the C-O-L-O-R-I-N-G. So that shimmer there now all into suspension. Trusty swatching tool, my cotton bud. And it goes, I put it right down to the bottom and I give it a good stir to try and make sure if there's any shimmer there that I get it onto this. Oh, I like this blue. Bit darker than what I was expecting. Reminds me a bit of Diamine Ode and Neil. I might fetch that out when I do my comparisons. Quite nice, I like this colour. It's an unusual blue, isn't it? And let's go there, and then nice and thick in the center. And we'll do a single pass down the side. My pen, my serendipity dip pen, broad your whole nib. So we've got diamine. Blizzard. And we've got ink vent. 2023, and this is Day number 18. Let's move that over to one side to dry. Whilst it's drying, in comes the Endless Recorder Notebook, 68 GSM Tomo River paper. So we've got day 18. And this is Diamine Blizzard. Very nice colour, this. Drying. So there's immediate. 10 seconds. 30 seconds. One minute. Fairly dry there. So, a sentence. I do like this colour, it's quite nice, isn't it? Let's give that a chance to dry, we'll move it over to the side. Whilst it's drying, in comes the chocolate advent calendar. So here we go, day number 18. Where's day 18? I can find 19 down here. 21, oh, 18. Santa's beard, making it hard to see the number. There we go. Let's get in there. Let's get in the camera as well, shall we? So we've got, is that holly with some holly beans on there? Not, not beans, berries. And we've got there, plum pudding, Christmas pudding. It's a nice thing in this house. I'm the only one who likes Christmas pudding, so I get to have one all to myself. Let's pop this away. I will fetch in the gift from my wife. So, a bit of a squishy one this time. Look at that, squishing away. Oh, and there's a bit of a hard part at this side. Let's see, what have we got? So we've got a twofer again. There's, I'm guessing it's a type of pen. What else have we got in here? So we've got Captain Marvel. Turn it over there, we've got Captain Marvel on the front. And I'm guessing this is a pen case. Looks really good, nice and squashy as well. That'll give plenty of protection from my pens in there. And I'm uh, doing this off camera, aren't I? I'm going to do a separate video because I got a Star Wars one earlier in the month. So I'm going to do a separate video where I'll talk more about these. Very nice. 
Captain Marvel, quite like Captain Marvel. I haven't seen uh, the Marvel's film yet. I did enjoy the Miss Marvel TV series, so looking forward to seeing that when I get around to it. What else have we got in here? We've got, I'm guessing, a pen. Let's open it up. Oh, it's a bit of a tight package. So we've got to open it up. We've got quite a nice looking pen, isn't it? Very nice. Love this, like a, a grey, maybe a greeny colour. Cat pulls off. Got a fairly small nib there. Let me just get my loop, see if it says what manufacturer it is. So on the nib, it says urine. My wife did leave me a note. The name of this pen is High Quality Ink Pen, so I'm not sure what the manufacturer is. I like the section as well. It's got that texturing on it. This will then go onto the pile of pens for first impressions sometime during the first half of next year. And yes, I'm saying the first half because there's a load of pens to do now. Pop that to one side for the moment. Let's fetch back in the ink swatch. So here we've got a gorgeous, like a bluey grey, or is it a grey blue? Not overly saturated. Beautiful the way that silver shimmer comes out, isn't it? Then on the top where I've done the writing, again, you can see that gorgeous silver there coming through. Didn't have many comparisons. In fact, both comparisons, now I'm looking at them, not even close, to be honest. So I thought it was a bit like Diamine Eau de Neil. Now I fetch it in that Eau de Neil is a lot darker, a lot darker blue and a lot bluer blue. The other one I brought in, this isn't actually a fountain pen ink. It's a dip pen ink. And I got this sometime around 2008 from a place called Sovereign Hill, which is near Ballarat in Victoria, which is part of Australia, obviously. And they've got there, it's like an old time, so set around the mining times. And part of it, they had a schoolroom set up and you could buy a dip pen and you could buy the ink to go with it, which is what this is from. So the ink has we've had it, as I say, since about 2008. Mm. That was the nearest I could come in terms of colour. Let's take a look at the chromatography. So here we go. Still wet. At the bottom we've got grey and we've got that shimmer there, that line of shimmer. Not much colour for a little bit, then it comes into some pinks. Got a little fringe of green, and then we've got some blue as we kind of come up towards the top. Give that time to dry properly. Let's move this out of the way. We're fetching that endless recorder notebook again. So day 18, Diamine Blizzard. Dries a nice colour. I do quite like the colour of this. I say I don't know, is it a grey blue or a bluey grey? I'm not sure how best to describe it. But when you see it, it looks really nice. And then pop, that shimmer really hits you in the face. You know, certainly on that day 18, look at Diamond Blizzard, virtually all of it shimmering away. Grumpy shimmering quite a lot. Wizards make, then we start to fade off with a shimmer. But nice, yeah, I really like the look of this. So this is Diamine, day number 18, Blizzard. I hope you've enjoyed today's video. What are your thoughts on the sink? What inks would you compare it to? Please drop a comment down below. Let's kickstart the conversation. Please hit the thumbs up button every time you like, every time you comment, just helps with the YouTube algorithm. If you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel so that you can get new videos as I release them. I'll talk to you again soon.